They say statistics mean nothing to the individual, but it was the stats around construction workers that helped pique the interest of Kira Thrasher. A lot of the people who are really good at those jobs are retiring or passing away. So there's a lot of open positions in just technical jobs and trade jobs. So that's one of the things that drew me to it. Thrasher first came to Wallace State Community College last year in the automotive program to learn how to use tools. But at a certain point, stopped fitting some of the things that I wanted to learn how to do just for myself. So she switched to the relatively new building construction program. During the first day of class, something unexpected happened. I was sitting at this table just going through my school emails in the morning and I was like, what is this? This isn't something I usually get in my inbox. Uh, and I read through it and you know, it said congratulations. So it was just really, really exciting. <laughs> The congratulations came from being chosen as one of the first two students in the state to win a $10,000 scholarship from the Alabama Construction Recruitment Institute. The Go Build Career Kickstart Scholarship was launched this summer to encourage young people into the construction trades. Thrasher's teacher Lynn White said with her eye for creativity and detail, he's not surprised that she was chosen. And if you look at some of our modern buildings and some modern technology, very, very creative individuals did that. And Kira's going to be one of those. She's going to be one of those that you know, this has been a childhood dream for her, and we want to foster that and, and help her to continue to grow from this program. Another unique part of the scholarship is that it will always be awarded to one male and one female student. They work just as hard, and so and they're just as motivated to see a project through as are my male students. And so I'm excited that, that this would, again, turn a spotlight on uh, more females in the crafts and in the trades. GoBuild says increasing the number of women in the construction trades is important because right now they only make up 10.4 percent of the industry. I think that women really would enjoy these jobs if they got into them, but maybe just don't consider them outright because they're traditionally a male-saturated field. Thrasher says when she's done at Wallace State, she hopes to use her experience to not only work in the traditional construction world, but also follow her dream of designing props for movies. Absolutely. I am a big fan of Peter Jackson's Lord of the Rings trilogy. I've watched all of the behind the scenes of uh, like we had a workshop making swords and armor and different props. I just I love it and I've always wanted to do things like that. <laughs> And the Go Build Alabama campaign also offers monthly scholarships of $1,000 to high school students. And in fact, this month's winner was a junior at Huntsville High School. Dan, Naja.